other agents who did not die in gunfight or by drowning have returned home safely to Ithaca from their latest mission. All, except Odysseus Ulysses. And he, though longing to return home to his wife, Money Penelope, and his country, has been captured and detained by the evil drug runner Calypso, who even now has him captive, bound and gagged in a warehouse in Albania. How can I forget Odysseus? Than whom there is no more capable man on earth, nor one more liberal in his offerings to this government or its people. But as I have said, by his own actions, Odysseus has enraged the Admiral Poseidon by blinding his favorite son, Polyphemus. He deserved it! Poseidon will not kill Odysseus outright, but he will torment him by preventing him from getting home. We shall, therefore, lay our heads together to see how we can help him return. Poseidon shall not triumph, for if we are all of a mind, he can hardly stand against us. If, then, the service now mean that Odysseus should get home to Ithaca, we should first send Mercury to Albania to tell, or maybe I should say persuade, Calypso, that we have made up our minds and that he is to return. Send in 006. Send in 006! Odysseus is lying in great pain in Albania, where dwells the nymphomaniac Calypso, who will not let him go. And he cannot get back to his own country, for he can find neither means to escape nor transport to take him over land nor sea. Since you have been our messenger before, and were with Odysseus when he was captured, go persuade this nymphomaniac with the hair so beautifully quaffed what we have decided. Namely, that patient Ulysses must be allowed to return. Double O sex appeal to her better nature. It shall be done. I hope that you will not be offended by what I'm going to say. 
Singing comes cheap to those who do not pay for it. And all this, whilst the bones of one so beloved may lie rotting in the wilderness or being ground to powder by the surf. Your wealth is great and your beauty greater. It is my wish that you begin thinking how to rid the halls of these men. I would! If these men were to see Odysseus return to Ithaca, they would pray for longer legs rather than a longer purse, for money would not then serve them. But he, alas, has fallen on an ill fate. And even when people do sometimes say they see him coming, we no longer heed them. I am sometimes afraid that we shall never see him again. Odysseus, my love, hurry home.